check it out. Yeah, you guys already know it. It is another little Fortnite figure here. This time, of course, it's the Enforcer. If you guys already remember, check it out. I mean, we got two of them back there that we opened previous. We do have a couple more. We do want to get all of them. I mean, we love to have, uh, you know, Wild Card, Havoc, and the Visitor. We already have these two. I would love to get them, um, but I just got to find them first. So check this one out. This one's the Enforcer. Definitely has cool skin. I mean, I don't see it too much in the game, but yeah, I, I love these things. So if you guys have some of these, leave it in the comments. Now, before we even start, while we're opening this thing, you guys, don't forget to uh, check out a lot of our giveaways that we're doing. I'm going to pop them up right there so you guys can see it, right? Don't forget to check those out and make sure that you are getting in on those. This way you guys can, you know, win Legos or win little figures and stuff that we put out because why not, right? If you're going to, if you're going to, watch videos why not like have the option to win something so let's open this thing up and check out the goodies in here so as most of you guys know i'm so sad that's not a sticker i wish it was a sticker it is glued on with like some type of glue can you guys see that right there there's some type of glue so you can't like take it off and put it in a notebook unless you did it like very very i guess if you let me see if i can do it i don't even think i don't even think i can't without tearing it all the way up yeah you can almost do it but it's gonna look all funny, so check that out. Not too bad. <laughs> so let's check out let's check out the figure. One of the cool reasons why I like these figures, if you guys know, is they have a lot of points of articulation. So you down there, 38 points of articulation. You guys are like, what does that mean? What's what's articulation? Well, articulation is the movement of the parts. So it's like the knees. Look at that. You can move the knees, you can move the the uh, ankles right or left you can move the toe up and down it's the same thing for the arms right you can move the arms up or down the arms back and forth the hip the torso so check that out i mean you have a lot of different positions you can put this guy in and that's what i think makes these things so cool is you have that option to kind of you know make these make these figures in a position that you want them in whether they're shooting a weapon holding their their pickaxe whatever it might be look at that one oh gosh that looks awesome <clears throat> check that out and again, you guys can see the closer view up of it over right there. But I think that is awesome when you have so many different positions that you can put them in, whether it's kneeling or crouching or, you know, whatever. There's just so many different things. And I can't wait till they come out with more weapons for these things because I think it is going to be sweet. So check out his pickaxe right there. <laughs> that is awesome. It almost looks identical to the games. I mean, for a lot of you guys who, have, who are watching this, I mean, that is awesome. And I love the fingers. See how the fingers can move? You guys see that? They come kind of in and out. So you can make him kind of grab stuff. So when he's running, boom, look at that. And these things, I mean, these things aren't small by any means. I think they're the six inch figures or the seven inch figures or whatever it is, wherever it says on here, what does it say? Age is eight plus, oh my gosh. Yeah, six inch figure. So <clears throat> I think it's awesome. I mean, I love the little small ones, but these bigger ones just rock. So how about let's do this? Let's take a look at some of these other goodies in here. Of course, one is his backpack, which is like this riot shield type thing. So check that out. That is just awesome. Let's throw it on there. And I'm definitely going to mix and match some of this stuff between the uh, Purple Skull Trooper and uh, the Rabbit Raider back there. I'm definitely going to mix and match. We got, of course, a little health potion right here. Now, I don't know where these fit on the people. If you guys know where these fit on the little figures, please tell me because I have no idea. I, I just don't see. I mean, it has a little, like, hole right there, but I don't know where it goes. So I've been throwing them in the bucket. Same thing with a nice little boogie bomb. This boogie bomb looks freaking awesome can you guys see the detail on that thing look at that that thing just looks awesome oh geez good paint job then of course it comes with two masks of course it looks like they're almost i mean they're almost identical but not too crazy and they usually come with two different faces on a lot of the figures so check out the two faces right there nothing too crazy i just usually throw them inside the box <laughs> and of course the gat itself let's take a look at this thing not too bad i think i like him with this pickaxe in this one i, I don't feel like the uh the sniper rifle here is oh yeah it looks like tiny comparison to gosh you see that like i feel like the uh suppressed the suppressed ar right here that that looks good this doesn't look to be the stock like size so i don't want to use it that looks good but the other one does not what do you guys think on that i don't it's that's just too small it's too small for what you think a sniper rifle would be look at that it's not even as big as this gosh anyways yeah, I think the set is, I think this this figure is probably not my best out of the three, or my favorite. I definitely love the Skull Trooper first, uh, the purple version, and then of course it's gonna come Rabbit Raider because I love that costume. And then maybe this one's my third most liked so far. I do love like the the, the kind of the hat and kind of the face and the uh, the scarf right there. I, I kind of like that, but 
I think the weapon on the Skull Trooper, I think, is by far more to scale than anything. So let me know what you guys think of this. Leave it in the comments. I haven't seen anybody say if they have these things or not. Um, and I don't see many reviews of them on, of course, YouTube because I'm just kind of curious what other ones people have. Anyways, thanks again, Fox fans. Definitely subscribe if you guys haven't already.